Okay, so with less than a week left to go in Boston, we're just doing the little little things we haven't done really since we've been here. The stuff we did as a family. So today we're going to go to the Philharmonic. This is it. This is the famous Boston hat shell where they do the 4th of July, every 4th of July, where they do the fireworks. Uh, they have concerts here. They have just about everything. They have Friday night movies. And on Wednesday nights, they have free orchestra. So little opportunity for culture, or at least this type of culture. The program tonight is all about discovery. What does a Mozart overture have to do with discovery? Well, I'll try to make a case. Yeah, we gotta go back to developing countries. This US life is too hard for us. Why? Too busy. It's too busy. It's too busy. It's, too busy. it's oh. way too busy. Okay. Alright, so these are the days before we take off and we're just lining up all last minute things, getting our luggage situated and getting in as much American processed chain food as possible. The last treat that the kids asked for is to get a pedicure, so... Do you deserve it? Yeah. So the kids are having a little bit of spa day before we take off? Is that, is that right? So that was worth it just? It was. It was. I'm all disheveled now. You know, yeah, I, I like your shoes, by I the don't, way. I don't get pedicures that often, but I really, truly do love them. And this was a massage one. And since I never got a body. Well, we have a little, you know, we have stuff left in there. So at this point, Jessica's aunt's come by and she's in the late 60s, I think. And uh, she's saying that she wants a hair like hairdo like Jessica. Right, yeah. right, 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 right. Yeah. Yeah. But you know what the funniest thing is? It's always women that are fascinated with that thing and want to. He may not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Alright, good job. Yeah. I'm going to France. Because um, uh, I like writing penny boards. Why am I moving to France? Because of the cheese. I just said that. And the wine. And I'm coming to visit. And I'm moving to France because we're going to live by the ocean and we get a lot more of this. Here's the deal. Sometimes I'll be talking, we'll be videoing, and I say, are you videoing? I don't really want this on video. He goes, don't worry, I'm, I'm not gonna, I'll put music to it. But my fear is that he... There's a triathlon about to start here. And I normally don't get up and rise up for races because usually I like to be in them, but I haven't ran in a while, and I haven't really gotten up for a race in a while. So I'm hoping this gives me a little bit of encouragement um, so that when we go to France I can get my ass in gear. So this is a triathlon series. I've never really done a lot of triathlons and primarily because of the fact that just the whole biking aspect of it is just so darn expensive. I mean, some of these wheels on these bikes are like $5,000. Here we go. We'll bring you on down to the start line. Come on down. Hey, here we go.
Yeah, I'm so ready to get back into this. I've, I've ran, I don't, go, I don't know if you call it competitively, but I've ran quite a bit in the last, I don't know, five, six years. Ran two marathons, who knows, countless other races. And, uh, and, I, and I've got the itch, I'm ready. I'm ready to get back into this because I'm only getting older and this is, only, this is the only thing that's gonna keep me from feeling older. Okay, so it's about 7.45 in the morning and this is the last Sunday morning that Jessica has to sleep in. So I have the hope and feeling that she's still asleep because this is our last day together and um, I want her to get as much rest as possible because tomorrow's gonna be a long day and when we get there to France, it's not going to be, we're not gonna be resting. They're still asleep. 2016 Equinox vehicles and stock. What is that? What are you doing awake, Ben? I'm awake. What are you doing watching TV, Alright, so uh this is our last day, we're gonna go rock climbing. And uh there's gonna be a lot of stuff going on today. No. Did you get big off? Friday. Friday. We'll need a waiver filled out unless you've done that before. Hello. No, we have to do it for, for Jess. So check out this massive place. It's called Salt Pump. Uh, salt Pump Climbing. It's got all these rooms with all these different types of uh, different rock climbing, from the basic to the more intermediate, then challenging and expert. Um, we're gonna be here for a while. Two part of the left, two part of the right. Oh, yeah. at the bottom of the. I think you can if you try. Jessica's now trying the little kids area and if we can't get past this, <laughs> we're just gonna call it a day. I don't think I'm gonna have the strength to do this. <laughs> I think we'll be fine, Jess. Look at this, this is like romper room here. It's like you're squatting or something. Like I'm what? I'm actually scared. Is it's like you're taking a poop. Is it's this just... hard? <laughs> it's hard. I need a break. Seriously? Yeah. 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 All right. Good job. All right. So we graduated, and now we're going downstairs. Twenty-nine. Twenty-five. <laughs> Are you tired, mister? No. Hey, Dad. Stay to the left. All right, so I made it to the top once, but these kids are just flying up, and this rock climbing business, it's, it's all upper body strength, so I just don't understand how the kids uh, are that I'm just weak. Packing up now, and it's time to uh, to get out of here because we gotta carry a whole lot of luggage tomorrow. It hurts to tie my shoes. Hey, hey who wants who wants some chocolate? Me. Yeah, I, I hear there's some chocolate mousse here. Chocolate mousse takes on a different flavor here. Can you can you believe this place? So funny. So this is Maine's version of chocolate mousse right here. 380 pounds of chocolate madness. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Can we go? What, chocolate lobster for yeah. dinner? Uh, for real. <laughs> I don't think so. Are you ready? Hey, Alan, could you be in that whole moose? Uh, no. Uh, This is awesome. I'm so happy. I'm happy at the drive-in. The kids are all happy in the car with their friend Natalie. And Will brought the really nice chairs. And life could not get much better right now. So Will dragged me out the night before we're supposed to be leaving to France when I should be packing and doing other stuff. To we're going for ice cream, cream all right? To an ice That's cream enough. place he heard was fantastic. All right. <laughs> it better be good. This is our last night in the U.S. And so at this point, we're just gonna go for our last ice cream of the summer and our last ice cream in the U.S. Where's the line? Like a knee. 
bread. I don't know. I know they bread. I get a small cone is like that much ice cream. It's not. Enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> Just how do you like your baby ice cream? It's a baby. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah. Holy shit.